Hello, fire signs. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are doing well. Let's see what's going on for you guys this weekend. So, wish granted. Star card. Healer. Yeah, so you're manifesting a good, something good coming towards you this weekend. Fire signs, Leo, Aries, and Sag. Leo, Aries, and Sag. Fire signs for the weekend. We have hidden talent. Uh-oh, somebody got some hidden talents to make, make something happen. Yeah, in the future, all right, it's going to be revealed. Some sort of hidden talent that you have you didn't know you had. Surprise, okay. So you may be finding out you have some sort of hidden abilities, okay. You ain't know you could do this. All right, this weekend, let's see. Fire signs, who Ari said. Yeah, words, with your words. So your words is powerful. <laughs> All right, so something about your words. You didn't know that you could do that. So if you know how to manifest through your words here. Ooh, if somebody was trying to steal something. Trust that somebody that's trying to outwit you with magic here knows the truth. All right. And they know that they're you're dedicated. They're yeah, somebody is wow. They know the truth about your dedication or what you are dedicated to here or what you want. Somebody know. Because of how you said something, your words, what you spoke out, or something like that. Fire signs, Leo Aries and Sage here. How you speak of someone. Alright. Somebody sees something clearly. Yeah. Like I'm looking at her eyes. Her eyes are pierced on someone. Alright, let's see here. Yeah, relax your mind. Clear your mind. Clear your energy. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, romantic love offer is coming in here. And we got desire. Yes. Ooh, somebody want to have sex with you. Alright, you know somebody want to have sex with you. How they talking to you or whatever. Okay. Yeah, child. Because they see you as a muse, honey. But I feel like you had to block communication or you block communication and they did some self-reflection like, hmm, that last thing you said to them kind of stands out here or vice versa. Last thing they said to you or you said whatever, it's standing out, okay? Hmm. I'm here an enchantress. All right, so, hmm, what's the message here? I'm hearing you was right all along. So somebody's having an awakening because you was right all along. Wow, okay, spirit, they quick. They said, not that, that. Okay, yeah, higher fence. Okay, this could be somebody you were married to or wanted you to miss an opportunity here. All right, you did the right thing. All right, in some way, shape, or form because somebody was trying to call it and balance to, uh, with passion or something like that. You caught them. How'd you know that? Like... I'm hearing you say you got a way with words or something like that. Or somebody said that to you and it kind of set something off in their mind or something. What is this? Yeah, two of wands. They put somebody in, in on the crossroads because they was trying to influence you. Incantation. I didn't want to say it, but whatever. Somebody was trying to influence you, but you picked up on their incantations and how their riddles or their words or how they were saying something. And you said it back to them and they like, oh, shit, you knew what I was saying here. So they like, oh, yeah, you the one. OK, Aries. All right. This could happen in Aries season or you're in between at a crossroads about this marriage, this relationship now. Yeah. Wow. Tower moment. Ooh, somebody had a one night stand or did something impulsively. Yeah, six of swords is the obstacle here for you guys to travel or move forward. Ten of cups. So, but somebody is happy about what you're saying. Eight of wands. Something that somebody said, it was harsh, but it was true though. What's the two of wands? Business like I'm glad you said that. <laughs> like energy. Yeah, somebody might want to apologize for whatever this is. What's the two of wands here? Yeah, because they chose to cause some sort of conflict, drama, or whatever this is. Leo energy here. Yeah, because they were mad that you was about to secretly, you could be secretly working on a marriage or you want to work on a relationship in secret or in private. You want to mind your fucking business. How are you mad about that? Somebody's mad because you're minding your fucking business, fire signs. Or you're mad because somebody's minding their fucking business on their marriage or in their relationship. Yep. 
because they lost this Queen of Swords. So they're mad that they're leaving them behind and it's there it's over. The ending of difficult times. But somebody says something they regret though. To this Queen of Swords and they left. Whatever they said to the Queen of Swords, she left them behind. Tower. What the fuck? What's the tower here? You you out because you were smart enough to know Queen of Swords could be you got air in your chart or you just smart. What's the tower here? Yeah, there was a shock to this damn Queen of Queen of Wands that you was confident enough here to get this money, okay? Or this shocked somebody that was in your family or something like that, or that somebody was married or about to get married or something like that in secret. What's the Queen of Wands that this Aries got married? Yeah, now they closed off to anybody's love offer coming forward, right? So this Queen of Aries or this somebody was closed off to somebody's love offer that was a Two of Cups. What's this Two of uh, Swords here? Star card. Now somebody is famous all over the world. Everybody knows this person. Now it's a heavy burden because the truth is they made the wrong judgment call when they were stuck. They thought they was going to get victory and success over this person, but that was a lie. This person was going to be a star, but they was closed off. And now they're shocked that like, what? Somebody beautiful in there, star. Everybody knows this. This could be you or them. Somebody wished they could start a brand new cycle with this person, but they was closed off to them because somebody was famous or they healed. What's the Six of Swords? The obstacle is to move things forward. Yeah, in this Ace of Cups situation. Somebody loved themselves enough. Four of Wands. Yeah, maybe because somebody moved towards new love and got married or is in a relationship. Four of Wands here. Yeah, Judgment got called on that. Yeah, since this plan... To block somebody with one night stands or to get some money out of them with sex or whatever. It ain't going to work. Ten of Cups. Alright. What's the Ten of Cups? Somebody is happy that you gained your strength here. Yeah. Enough to reconcile or to temper yourself or be patient. Alright. Strength card. Yeah. Because somebody is trying to cause an imbalance and you blocked it. Could be a Leo or a Capricorn or a Pisces. What's this Two of Pentacles here? They definitely are struggling. Yeah. Four swords. Yeah, they are hurt or sick that this Libra or Capricorn or whoever is the Queen of Pentacles. Yeah, and somebody tried to do something in secret to their work and they sabotage themselves. And now there's a new love offer coming in for this Aries to this uh or to Emperor Two of Cups. They're planning to work together here to block somebody's ten of pentacles because of jealousy and anger. Because they love somebody. This Leo is still in love with someone. And they don't want this person to move on. Or Leo, they don't want you to move on. Because they're still in love with you. Alright? Because somebody is the queen of pentacles. And they're sick about that. Like, oh my god. Or somebody's mother is falling ill. Because of this imbalance here. I'm here. Somebody is definitely... Uh, maybe that's what they was thinking. That something was going to be laid. The rest that they call the cause the imbalance. But somebody is still seeing... Somebody in the Queen of Pentacles energy. Very loving, nurturing, kind, financial stability. All right. Yeah, we got old loves here. So this could be somebody from your past. We got Taurus here that was trying to hex or curse somebody. A Sagittarius soul contract with a new love here. All right. Let's see here. Yeah, some, for money. This is all surrounded money. So somebody got money and that's why... 404, the divine is putting a sacred light of protection around you on Tuesday. Or they did. Yeah, E, F, G, and H. Why can't I find somebody like you? Somebody got mental issues, though. M, N, O, R, P. Yeah, Scorpio here. That's low vibrational. You learned this, so you get to let them go. All right. Q, R, S, T. First, last, middle, initial. We got true love. L M N Wow. I J K and L. First, last, middle, initial. True love. <laughs> Somebody saw the they can't believe they messed this up, shaking their head because something is over with their true love. They could have chose the wrong person. Yeah, their empress. They chose, they denied their empress. Yeah, they thought, I don't know. They was the one, but they about to lose you for good a year ago. So somebody lost somebody a year ago last year. Alright. Yeah, yeah, you made the right choice here. Um, I feel like somebody lost this person, for, yeah, because they made good choices or whatever. I don't know, but we got a Pisces here, all right, on Sunday. You, Y, and Z. I feel like somebody has the ability to uplift the hearts of everybody around them, 
like an earth angel, okay, or an angel on earth, because somebody's an earth angel here. I hope this helps you, fire signs. Sending you guys an abundance of love, light, and healing vibes, and I'll talk to you later.